and IMB Unchanged also. Australia's top skydivers have arrived in Picton for the national championships starting this weekend. Up for grabs is a spot on the Australian team which is headed to Russia for the world titles. It's an extreme way to spend your spare time, jumping out of a plane, performing a series of formations thousands of feet above the ground. But these guys are good at it and they're back in Picton for the National Skydiving Championships. We've got, we've got plenty of teams already up at Picton training for the event and fingers crossed the weather's on our side as well. Picton is heaven for skydivers. The weather is generally perfect for flying. And the planes, really. They've got the big aircraft so you can take lots of people up at the same time. And they're similar aircraft to what they use at the bigger competitions at the World Championships. Already this year the venue hosted the National Canopy Piloting Championships. It will be slightly different to that. Uh, we're not flying across the ground. It's all in air. Um, up, all the competition is done before you actually open your parachute. Wollongong's Julia McConnell will take her place in the Canopy Formation team. This is our fourth uh, national championships that we'll be competing in. We've won the last three so hopefully we'll make it four in a row. And there's added incentive for a win this time around. Being a world championship year, the top performers will gain a spot on the national team to compete in Russia. The competition is set to start on Sunday, day, and if the conditions are right, it should be wrapped up by the middle of next week. There'll be great footage um, in air, uh, lots, of, lots of fast action. It's going to be a big year this year. They're planning on lots of records to be broken, I hear. Rob Beaumont, Win News. Sport is next with Amy Taylor, who's down at the Wynn Entertainment Centre for Game 2 of the NBL Grand Final series.